Hello students, welcome back to my channel. In today's lecture, I am going to draw a curve using tangent method and that is a parabola. Like base of 120 and axis 40 is given. That is nothing but millimeter dear students. As in the question paper, sometimes they won't give you the base and axis. The question is just direct like draw parabola using tangent method. But what I am going to do here is we are supposed to locate the base as well as the axis. So how much is the base? The base of this tangent method parabola is nothing but 120 millimeter. That means that is nothing but 12 centimeter on your scale. Please locate this on dying sheet that is nothing but 120 million later in order to locate the axis we are supposed to take the center position that is nothing but six centimeter that means six millimeter from there we are supposed to trace the axis let a b is nothing but the base and 60 i mean 40 is nothing but the axis from the center position of a b line that is nothing but 40 so draw a line perpendicular to this please try to work out using only the drafted yes students now this is cd later we are supposed to extend cd further again into the equal uh, i mean the equal point that is 40 that is nothing but cd equals to oc cd equals to oc cd equals to oc dear students so extend this line stating that oc draw only using project i mean the drafted year students to get a better i mean the perpendicular lines later join a to o later join a to o and as well as a to i mean o to b joining a to o as well as o to b. so that you are going to get you are going to get this uh the base with 120 and the axis cd with 40 and further cd equals to co this is how you are supposed to later you are supposed to trace i mean divide this a o line as well as o b line into equal number of divisions into equal number of you know how to divide a line so from a take any angle take any angle and divide this line into any number of divisions divide this line into any number of divisions i know you know how to divide it so i am drawing uh, i as i don't have the compass now i am dividing with the scale take keeping in view that this i'm taking one centimeter this complete division so this is nothing but one two three four five and six divisions i mean you can make any number of division dear students by adjusting your compass and placing one as the center cut this two as the center cut this so on i hope you know that how to work out later you are supposed to join the last division of the uh, division of this line to o similarly draw all parallel lines from this a line to a o line i hope you know how to divide a line if not please try to uh, uh, watch in my channel i have posted how to divide a line into equal number of divisions this is how you are supposed to mark the division of a line later i am naming this as one and this as two and three so on four five i have made into these many equal number of divisions. it doesn't mean that it need to be divided only into five you can make into any number of divisions any number of division later i told that we are supposed to divide even the ob line so what you can do is place your drafter parallel as well as, i mean 90 degree and make dots upon this so that you are going to get the equal divisions even on ob side of the line dear students ob side of the line so this is how you are supposed to divide to make your drawings very fast now we need to number from the down in the reverse order why because it is a tangent method so i am going to locate four five here and this is four dash and this is three dash and this is two dash and this is one dash why because we are supposed to locate the tangents so for one one dash is a tangent that's the reason this is being given the name tangent method so for one draw to one dash and from two draw to two dash so similarly you go on working draw all the tangents draw all the tangents from all these points so that you are going to get a curve finally and that curve is said to be a parabola curve that curve is said to be a parabola curve after drawing all these tangents 
later the space provided here is nothing but the gap this is nothing but a parabola curve so look how i am going to trace this from all these points so this is the curve which we are going to get finally you'll be getting much better why because you are going to use the instruments as i am not using instruments here so this is how you are supposed to trace the points from o to o to i mean a to b so taking hb pencil now and drawing all the points so that you are going to get a curve and that curve is nothing but a parabola curve and this is nothing but the tangent method curve this is how you are going to get a parabola curve and do not forget writing the dimensions after finishing your diagram and even the naming of this that is nothing but a tangent method that is nothing but a tangent method that is nothing but a tangent method so this is how you are supposed to trace the curve parabola using tangent method and this is given as 1 for 120 and this complete thing is divided split into two halves that is nothing but 40 and 40. Dear students, please do like my videos and share to your friends so that it may help them in drawing the engineering graphics problems very neatly as well as you are going to work out the dimensions like this to get a good marks in your examination. This is how you are supposed to trace the curve that is nothing but a tangent method, a parabola curve. Thank you.